Hello again, folks. Uh, welcome to lesson 42. This is kind of um, more of you trying things out now. I've done lots of demonstrations and examples and things like that, and now we're doing more of the theoretical kind of work. But what you read about in these next few lessons should be nothing really that new to you. So you should be prepared and have some experience with statics and are comfortable to start reading and doing the theory on your own. So let's just take a look here, down here at what you're going to do. So we are doing, as you can see, if you want to pause it to write down what you need to do, but I also have it on the classroom, right? You're going to do lesson 42, reading and concept sheet. You're going to read 9, 5, 9, th or 9, 2, 9, 5, 9, 3, and 9, 5. And those are the questions you're going to do. And then you're going to do the concept review sheet. And I'm giving you two days to do that. So this might be a little bit easier for you. You might have a little more time to try it. And of course, later on, once everybody's submitted what they can do, I will post the answers and we'll go through them. Uh, so let's take a look at what you're doing. So this is the sheet you should be looking at. This is where you're starting. So for 9-2, you're going to do 1 to 5 on the concept review. And I've highlighted it for you right there. So that's what you're doing. You're doing 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And try 5, but it might be hard. All right. Then you're going to move on to 9-3. And you're going to do 1, 4, and 5. So 9-3, charging by friction. 1, 4, and 5. Then you will read 9-5. And you can try 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. 5 is a tricky one, but you can give that a try. Then you'll move on to the electrostatic concept review sheet here, and you will do the back side of that well. And this is the hardest question you'll have to do, and it will be on a test type of situation. So now, that's what you're doing. Now, if you're having problems with something and you can't get a quick result, uh, just leave it because we will be posting answers and going through them. So do your best. And um, don't panic if something's a little confusing. Sometimes I find it's actually the question that's not that hard. It's the way that they word them using very formal scientific language. And then if I maybe re-explain the question to you in a more casual way, you get it. So sometimes it's the wording. Um, but you should be able to read through. All the answers for the questions can be found in the booklet, except for the ones that I said try that are a little bit harder, but you just try those. If you can't get them, that's okay, because we'll go through them later. Um, so once again, I'm just going to quickly uh, send you on your way, but uh, what you need to do, let's look down here. For concept review, you're going to read 9, 2, 1 to 5, 9, 3, 1, 4, and 5, and 9, 5, 1 to 5. And then you're going to do the electrostatic concept review sheet front and back. And that's what you're going to do. Like I said, you have two days to work on it. Once you're done, submit everything on the classroom, and we'll see you soon.